Hi, everybody. We're in step two of section two, uh, creating easy access for your members to join your money network. I have an example here uh, of what a private network looks like. I'm a member of the Mindful Living Collective. It's a free, currently a free uh, money network, uh, but there's an approval process where with a request to join button. And if you're going in there, you would see once you get in, and I will give you an example of this, actually, I'll go to there. Go to their landing page. So they have a offsite landing page, but they have this join now button. And then that goes to their landing page for the money networks, which is the request to join. Um, so they would see this first if they were, if they were in, they were looking to join, they would see that. And then they would have to sign in if they were, if they were already a member. So there's an approval process when you have a private money network. And you can't sell at the door. So if there's, for example, you are charging for the network membership, you would have to do that elsewhere or in some other capacity um, in the money network because the landing page to the money network doesn't allow for you to collect any money up front. Uh, once they send the request to join, they get um, the host gets a notification that says somebody's requested to join. Uh, there's a questions that you've customized for that person to answer. And so the host can then review those answers. And I can say, okay, looks like Deb's filled out all of the uh, information and she looks like a great match for our community and our network. And so I'm gonna approve that request. And then as a host, when you approve the request, then the um, member gets a notification. Congratulations, you're approved to join the Mindful Living Collective. And then there is prompts for them to come in and join. The, 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 the pros for this is like, if you don't want anybody to access the content, you want people to have that approval process, you like that there's questions and um, that you can deny people if you see like they're not answering the questions or they're not a right fit, maybe they're just not really that interested if they didn't fill out some of those questions or maybe answer them in full details. So you could actually deny people who are request uh, to join your network. Um, and it allows you to have a free network um, with this approval process in place. You, and you still have the ability to sell courses or groups inside your main network. So those are still possibilities for you, meaning, meaning you just would have a main space that would be free. And then in that uh, network, you if you have paid places like a course or a group, then those would be things that you could sell to the people once they get into your network, but there's no payment gateway before that at this door. So at the door that you're at with a private, uh, the cons here, again, maybe that uh, clunkiness of the onboarding experience for their first um, time as they request, as they request to access, those emails can get lost and in the translation, it can get confusing. It also delays them from actually getting in the network. So if they say they're ready to, to join now, um, but they have to wait until, you know, a couple hours later or the next day, they might not have time when they get the approval notification to like go in right away. And that leads to just maybe people that aren't, you know, gonna come in your network. They can also, those emails that the Money Network sends on behalf of your you as a host, they can go into spam or junk folders, meaning then the, the person might have to say, I requested and I never got the confirmation. Um, and so that can lead to some other unpleasant conversations just between members or like people that never even got into your network because they just had, it was a confusing and clunky process and they didn't really feel like dealing with that. So um, they just never ended up joining. So those are some um, hesitations why I would say not to use the private setting. Um, there's no way to charge, like I said, from that doorway. So if you're trying to charge for your money network as a member subscription, that's not available to you in this capacity. Um, so there's just a couple questions that you could consider. And I'm gonna go to the next section. We're gonna talk about public uh, doorways.